Yeah, where are, you, where are you from then? From Israel? Israel, from Jerusalem. I'm Eli Shavit. Right. From Jerusalem, Israel. And this is my wife, Shula Shavit. And also from Jerusalem, Israel. And so do you come especially to Margate to do this and today? We came to yes. Margate especially for the festival. Yeah. And fortunately for us, we have great weather. Not as much wind as we would like to have. But yeah, it's, that's what, it's, it's, it's not raining. That's what so, I was thinking. It's very light wind. Does it make it quite difficult? Yes. It is. We did get a few hours of relatively good wind, but overall the day has been pretty light as far as the wind goes. Hopefully tomorrow we'll, we'll get a better So you're here day. for both days? Yes, yes. we're going to be here today and tomorrow. And did you come last year? No, no. this is our first time in Margate. Time right, okay. And what do you think of Margate? Is it nice? Yes. It seems like to be like it. a very nice town. We only came in yesterday in the evening, so we didn't get to see much of the town. But yeah. It seems to be a very nice place. Yeah. Well, thanks for having a chat to me anyway. You're From a city called the Cervia, which is on the coast on the Adriatic Sea, in between Venice and Rimini. And you're Katrina, right? Yeah, I'm Katrina. Right. And um, how do you, how did you get into flying kites then? Uh, my father has been a kite flyer since uh, 30 years, for 30 years already. So since I was a child, I was into kiting. And uh, me and my father, we organized together a kite festival uh, in Italy. Which is, uh, you organize your own festival? Yeah. Right. What's festival, that called? An international kite festival, which is called the Cervia International Kite Festival. Right. And uh, uh, this year it will be the 30 years. So it's one of the eldest kite festivals in Europe. All really? Around Europe and in the world as well. Yeah. So this is this festival is quite a new one, isn't it? Yeah. About two I or think three it years, maybe? Yeah, second or third year, yeah. And how do you think, what do you think of it? Sorry? Is this the first time you've been? Yeah, the first time. Probably. And you enjoying it? Yeah, of course. Yeah. <laughs> Always with kites. Yeah, I'm, I'm, uh, I, I really hope to have more wind later on, but... Uh, right, so we go. This kite? Yeah, this, this kite is a painted kite. Painted? It, yeah, it's paint, it's, and painted by my father, who is a painter. Yeah. More than a kite flyer. And uh, the shape is a rokaku. It's a rokaku kite, traditional from Japan. It is a traditional kite. You will see other kites like this one, like that one uh, on the sky, to hopefully later on. Yeah. And it's a fighter kite. So a fighter? A fighter. So it, this kind of kite is uh, usually um, um, used to, to fight. Okay, really, <laughs> for fighting. And it's very funny. Of course, I don't fight with this uh, painted kite because. Uh, It'd be a shame. Yeah. <laughs> so what does it depict then? Sorry? It's obviously a baby. Is it anyone's child? Yeah, it's just a baby. Uh, just a baby, yeah? Imaginary. And uh, this kind of, um, of course, of paint uh, pittura, you can see very well the paintings when it's flying, of course. Uh, when you see... You see yeah, when it's in the air, you see it better. Yeah, traces of colours right now, but when it's flying, it's beautiful. Yeah. yeah. Closer to me is a purple pipe which does need to get into the pipe actually. How's it going today? It's got very difficult. Why is that? Because the wind? Yeah, the wind's just dropped. It's I funny, it's been really windy yeah, all week. I, un I understand, you can hardly stand up here last week. I lived just up there on the coast and uh, to get out of my car after work and he could hardly stand up, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Put a kite face along and the wind drops. Perhaps it'll, um, perhaps it'll pick up later or tomorrow. Well, let's hope, let's hope so. Yeah, yeah. Once you get some height, you're laughing. It's just getting the height in the first place. Really? Yeah, if you can get Where are you from then? Um, just outside Oxford, a place called Abingdon. Hmm. It's the first time you've been to this one? Yeah, it is actually, even though it's the third one, it's the first time I've been here. Yeah, yeah. That's becoming quite a good thing, I think. Yeah. People are really sort of starting to take to it. 
Last year was really good. Yeah. I mean, it's one of those kite festivals and one of these things that are very weather dependent and you can't organise the weather. You can organise the festival, but you can't organise the weather. You can't, you can't. So I'm just filming, doing a bit of filming. I work, I work for the local paper. Oh, right. I'm just doing a bit of filming problem, so don't mind if I use what you say, do you? No, no. No, it's, just, it's only a little bit, you know. We're talking to... So I didn't realise it's from so far away. Like, she's from Italy and Israel and all oh, that. Oh, yeah, yeah. There's people all over the place. And it's great. I mean, the whole festival is organised by the Kite Society of Great Britain. Do you, um, do you make your own ones? Yeah, I do. This one isn't one I made. Is that a bought, bought one, is it? Yeah, it's Dang yeah. Tang Pee Pee, actually. <laughs> right. What's your favourite kind, then? Um, well, I like... I don't do inflatable kites like this. I like kites with frames. Yeah. Well, um, more, a bit more traditional, I guess. Yeah. I, I've got no objection to these soft kites. It's just you can't do it all. And... How old? You, what's your name? How old are you? I'm Blaze, and I'm eight years old. Blade. Blaze. Blaze. Okay, Blaze. What do you think of the festival today? It's cool. Are you from Margate? Yeah. Yeah. And what, what do you like about it then? It's like loads of kites and yeah. Um, really cool. What about you girls? Where are you? Are you all from local? Um. Yeah. I live in Ramsgate. I'm called Macy, and I'm nine. Right. And about you? What do you think? What do you What do you guys think of it down here today? Well, I think it's quite cool, and uh, I like that big white one that would look like a ghost. Oh, the spirit kites. Yeah. yeah. Why Why do you like that one best, Sim? Because it just looks all like that. <laughs> right. <laughs> well, have a good time anyway. Hope you enjoy it all. Yeah, Cheers. <laughs> Closer to me is a purple kite which does need to get into the 